on this gridly? What game are we going to play you last? Well, just look at the, the screen. The US is most wanted. Now, I'm sure many people have never heard of this game. And quite frankly, be thankful if you've never heard of this game. Be thankful. I'm going to play it. And we're going to go ahead and just dive right in. I really don't want to dive right in. But I feel it's my duty as a Let's Player to play bad games. Very bad games, like this one. This game, it's very bad. Very, very, very bad. I don't want to play it, but I thought, you know, it'd be interesting. Let's take a break from an actually good game like Area 51 to play this. And guess what? I had to turn all of my settings down for this game. Honestly, I don't think it deserves the effort. Now, let's talk a little bit about this game while I'm uh, doing what I'm supposed to do here. This game was made by Activision. Well, not really. I mean, it was made by a joint company in Activision. And, uh, called Activision Value, I think. And... The engine was developed by uh, Fun Labs, who are thankfully now defunct, because this game's engine, like, the, I mean, there's really nothing good about this game, but the I think the engine is the worst part about it. And it was made in 2002. And in 2000, I think, two years before this, a game called Deus Ex came along, and Deus Ex as one of my favorite games ever. And then two years later, you think, you know, we get a little bit better. I mean, come on, how could you get better after Deus Ex? That game was great, and we were just ex on our toes expecting the best, and we got this little number. This game. A game where you're a guy sliding across the floor. Woo, look at me, sliding. Woo! It looks like he's charging. Charge! Charge! The most wanted girl with an uh, with a giant iguana. Somebody care to explain why she's ha why she has a, a giant iguana? I don't think there is a reason why she has a giant iguana. But anyway, we're supposed to be looking for clues. The controls in this game are just bad. Look, look, you automatically, like, right when you start the game, you're automatically walking. And the walking is just so awkward. I mean, look at you, you like, you bob up and down, sure, that's realistic, but it just really just feels completely awkward to walk around. And jumping. Don't even get me started on how bad jumping is. So, we're supposed to be looking for clues in this apartment. Apparently a burglar has came in here, and come in here, and burgled some stuff. And there's a bat, and we're supposed to look for clues of a struggle, I think. There's a gun. Can I take the gun? Can I please take the gun? Gun. I know some of you might be hearing me hitting the space hitting the space bar because that's the use key <sighs> I'm so sorry I know what your p people are thinking come on let's play some more area 51 but I decided you know let's let's you know let's have some variety let's do good games and bad games and after this I'll be doing a good game area 51 probably and after that I'll probably do another good game. But for now, let's just play this game, which is bad. And I know you don't want to want to see me play it, but we're going to play it. I thought it'd be interesting because when I was a kid, maybe 13 years old, Right now I'm 16, so it's really not much of an age difference, but when I was 13 years old, I picked up this game from Big Lots. My poor feeble mind. 
didn't comprehend how bad this game was, and I played it, thinking, you know, it's pretty cool. My poor 13-year-old mind did not know the horrors of this game. Please, whenever you grow up and have children, and then your children have chil their children, tell them to never speak of this game. Tell them U.S. is most wanted, never existed, and they'll live a good and healthy life. Not knowing this game ever was mass produced over the country, which I couldn't even fathom. But the sad reality is that this game was released in 2002, two years before, two years after the Mass Effect, I mean the, the Deus Ex came out, wow that's a big mess up, two years after Deus Ex, one of the greatest games ever came out, this game came along and decided, you know what, you know, I think we're a good game. Obviously, they didn't test this game before they released it. I cannot find anything in this apartment. I mean, if burglars were in here, they really were clean. I mean, there's really nothing, no hard evi evidence against these uh, burglars, allegedly, that came in here. So, I'm going to go ahead and save right here. And when we come back, we're just going to keep looking around in this house for clues that probably can't even find. <sighs> Lord help us all.